guys, Carl Cooper here with OnTheBlack.com. So as I'm sure all of you know by now, Mets closer Francisco Rodriguez is out for the remainder of the season with a torn ligament in his hand, which came from uh, the alleged assault on his father-in-law. Uh, if I'm the Mets, I have to do one of two things here, and they both lead to the, aim, the same end result, which is that uh, K-Rod should never, ever pitch for the Mets again. Uh, the Mets have to, in my opinion, either look at one, uh, either avoiding his contract, which of course there are uh, rules and policies around that, and, and you might have to get into it with the union a little bit. Uh, and K-Rod is also due, I think, uh, either 11 or $12 million next year, so that might be a, a tall hurdle to climb. But uh, one, they either should uh, avoid his contract and get him out of here, or two, um, they have to try to move him in the offseason via the trade, which also might be difficult because there's going to be the question mark of whether or not he's going to be healthy. But again, I think that K-Rod uh, should never pitch for the Mets again. The reason why I say that is because there's a pattern here. I mean, this isn't K-Rod's first incident. You can go back to last year when uh, there was reports that uh, he got into a very heated uh, shouting match with at the time, um, Tony Bernazard, who was still in the Mets at the time, with the Mets uh, organization at the time. And then you can talk about this year, too, where it was reported that he got into a heated exchange with the bullpen coach uh, during a game. So uh, there's a pattern here. Uh, this uh, latest incident is probably the worst um, of the three, is the worst of the three, because, uh, you know, it allegedly took place in front of uh, other family, uh, other players' wives and kids and family members. And, you know, it's one thing for this team to be terrible on the field. It's another thing for them to have players who are going to embarrass the organization off the field. And so uh, we'll see what the Mets do here over the over the coming days and weeks. But in my opinion, uh, K-Rod should never pitch for the Mets again. The Mets either have to look at voiding his contract and getting him out of here. And if they can't do that, they need to look at moving him in the, in the offseason after he has surgery and proves that he's healthy. Love to hear your guys' thoughts. We'd love to hear your thoughts, guys. Let me know what you think, and I'll talk to you soon.